You collected one cats. Here we go. Welcome back. I haven't forgotten about you GB Studio fans and I've made a font for you here that is kind of like a fantasy font. It looks like handwritten or whatever, which I think is pretty cool considering the default GB Studio font is pretty boring. I'm going to add the font to both my free to use in-game uh, art asset pack and Gerb's Adventure. Gerb's Adventure is an entire GB Studio project. So when you download it, you can see how I set stuff up and just whatever, grab the font right out of there. Okay, so let me show you how this font looks in GB Studio and also might as well show you how to put it in. Okay, so what you need to do is pretty simple. You can open up my um, art assets and then in there go to Game Boy. And then in Game Boy, if you scroll down, you will see the Pixel Pete font. The default font in GB Studio is it's pretty boring. It doesn't really have any like theme to it, you know? Check out this dialogue. I think it's pretty silly. Yes, move in, buddy. No, you smell. Okay, so to replace the font, go to your project folder. And in there, when you go into assets, you will find a folder called fonts. And that's where you're going to want to replace whatever font that you have there. So now if I uh, click on a character that says something, and if we hover over the dialogue, we can see the new font and check that out. It looks pretty cool. Let me actually hit play so I can show it to you in game. Check it out now. It's got like a cursive, uh, you know, fantasy vibe to it now. Look at the difference. Now it has so much more style. I hope you guys enjoy that font. And remember, you can use all of these assets in your game. I don't even care if you give me credit. If you're new to the channel, I'm a game developer working on Dwarf, a tower defense dungeon crawler RPG. And it's almost done. Support that indie dream and wish us it on Steam. Links in the description. Enjoy that font. I'll see you guys next time. A Devla.